Welcome back, guys. Last time we left off, uh, we had killed Jezebel Locke. And we had to come back and talk to Je uh Sorry, we had to come back and talk to Damsel, the uh, resident communist of uh, this scenario. The one who thinks, like, communism doesn't work with uh, mortals, but it'll work with vampires. Uh, yeah, well, sure. And, uh... You know, we didn't really have enough time in the last video to do that, I, I don't think. I don't know how it's going to last, how long it would last for talking, but uh, I wanted to make sure we had plenty of time to listen to her, all her crap, no matter how uh, nauseatingly uh, stupid it was. So let's, uh, let's listen to her. About Paul, he's dead a few days. It wasn't pretty. Yeah, so I think I made some sort of mistake on that like I went into his apartment before I got this mission and nothing was there I didn't see a computer to log into either to like get his messages and stuff so it wasn't like I could go in and like look at anything but maybe I just missed it I could go back to his apartment and try to find it for like uh, role-playing reasons or at least for the content I'm not going to because uh, I don't care so let's see we told him to burn the blood and go to the hospital. Said he thought he'd get over it. Kind of stubborn that way. This proves the plague bearer's body he found. Do you know what this uh, symbol on the flyer is? Yeah, I've seen this. Pretty sure I've seen it around here somewhere. One of the buildings, I think. Yeah, we're gonna have, but we're about to have a really interesting time. Uh, I'll look for it. But uh, I have, I want to see if she'll say any more. I have some questions. Yeah. yeah nothing right now. So basically, uh, there's a symbol on the flyer. In fact, last time I got some stuff, and I should have, uh, I should have like looked into it. But let's look at the flyer, flyer first. A skull with uh, all those things coming out. Yeah, we've seen that before. I've seen it before. I haven't actually commented on it. I thought about commenting on it, but uh, I figured we'd let that go to uh, when it actually became relevant. So that's the Brotherhood Flyer. Uh, appointment book? No, that's not it. Um, diary, this one was our... Uh, that's not it. No, that isn't it. What's this? I know there was some sort of book. Oh, here it is. Oh. That is beneath your ability to use, so I just have to sell it. It improves my dodge talent. So I've been... Uh, if you haven't noticed so far, we've gotten a lot of... Uh, a lot of books here that are very, very good, but uh, they were on talents I sort of picked right off the get-go, and uh, maybe that's my bad. I don't know. They're quite useful. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. Having having a high defense stat very early in the game is quite use useful. So I don't regret the fact that I chose that much dodge that early. If I had chosen Brawl, I might not have been able to get that free Brawl point from, uh, what's his name? Nines Rodriguez. So, uh, if you want to think about it, you've seen the books I've collected so far that give you free talent points. And all, all I've gotten like maybe five or six. And, uh, all but two of them I haven't actually been able to use because I had them pumped up too high before I even got to the point. But if you do that, you still get to sell them. So if you had read it, you wouldn't be able to sell it for $50, 50 or whatever it is. So I guess it's kind of a balance. Is $50 worth a stat point? Yeah, well, not really, but... Um, I didn't really come into it thinking, you know, min-maxing or whatever. I didn't. I didn't come into it thinking. There's only one thing 
that I knew to uh, you know try to get the maximum points out of, and that was the uh, that was the uh, asylum character that was uh, Jeanette and Therese. Like if you do it just right, you can get six points instead of five or four or whatever. And uh, I completely screwed that up. So clearly, my min-maxing ability is is quite low. So don't, you know. But we're we're playing. It doesn't really matter, honestly. And that and that's true for like a lot of games. Is that even you know if you're playing you know Diablo two for example. I don't play Diablo three. So I don't know how it is. Um. But if you're playing Diablo 2, like, there's a way to, like, maximize your points beyond anybody, anything else, or whatever. Do you actually need to do that to win the game? No. And you don't need to do this to win the game. I mean, I've had... The biggest challenge was that, uh, underground whatever... That, that, gar that, that motor garage, the automobile garage, uh, thing... And uh, I ran around like a lunatic, getting shot at, and I still somehow, unbelievably, managed to get, uh, managed to get, uh, managed to still survive. Damsel has told you that the symbol on the flyer you should found you found when you kill them was uh, very near the building. So yes, she's right. I'm going the wrong way. It's over here. No, it's not. It, I know where it is. It's very near to the uh, Tremere headquarters. Which is kind of weird. He's a regent. He doesn't know the huge cult is right next to him. I mean, you'll see it. I'll show you. I'll show you where it is. So here's the Tremere headquarters. That's the Tremere area. They got this weird purple light going on at the top. Yeah, but... You know, the worst off I was was that uh, the the, the clo I mean, I died a couple times. The, clo the you know, I died once or twice, three times, something like that, on that uh, mission where I went downstairs on the, uh, the the parking garage mission, right? And. Uh, Let's talk to this guy. Are you enlightened yet, brother? Yeah, I'm enlightened. What do you I think? See. Welcome to the Brotherhood. The bishop will see you upstairs. All new brothers and sisters must go and see the bishop. He's waiting for you. Go on. I must, huh? I'm gonna go into sneak mode. Well, I forgot. I forget now what I was saying before, and I don't really care anyway. I'm gonna turn on my blood uh, shield. I'm gonna use this one because uh, if you sneak, this won't betray my sneak. If I shoot him with uh, my highly, uh, with my uh, maximum ammunition uh, crossbow. My sneak will not be betrayed, so I'm gonna. Do... What's this? That might be someone to talk to. I'm not gonna shoot them first. See what happens. I see. I'm. I'll. I'll talk to this person. Hey, did did you get summoned? You're going up upstairs to see the bishop. Summoned? You're n new to the Brotherhood, huh? Just got enlightened. I, I've been here a few days. <laughs> when the bishop wants to see you, you'll be summoned, and then you go up these um, these stairs up to the, the t temple. Hmm. The temple. What goes on up, up there? I, I don't know. I mean, I, I hear things, but but I haven't been summoned. I had a friend snuck up there a few days ago. Said 
she saw things, bad, bad things. Yeah. What did she see? Blood. She said, um, b -b blood everywhere. She, um, she saw a few of the summoned to try to, uh, oh, to talk to them, but they just, just stared at her with these, um, these woo blank looks, you know? No, one of them, uh, started reaching for her and she, she ran away. Huh. Sure you'll be summoned soon and then you can join her. <laughs> you sound scared. Maybe the Brotherhood isn't all it's crapped up to be. A three at that. Yeah. I know. The, the bishop said we have to shed our um, our uh, our earthly fears on our journey to the to the ninth circle. But I'm um, scared to go upstairs. I I just uh, I just I just want to go home. You know I want to go home. Well, you should go home. Uh, don't worry. You won't have to worry about the bishop anymore. Well, that's true. I'll take care of him. But maybe there's a better option. Soon you will join the bishop and the worship in the temple. See it? No. Come here. I have something that ease your pain. I don't need any blood. That's number three. So I'm gonna go to number one. Please, I, I just, I want to go oh, home. I do need blood. Well, that's stupid. Please, I... I just... I want to go home. <laughs> it's okay. You see how... I did that conversation with her, and it, 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 uh... It got rid of my weapon here. That's quite annoying. Why did it do that? Like I said, even now, the <laughs> even now, years later, the game is still buggy. Suck the blood out of those guys. It's really weird they decided to make the uh, the crossbow the equivalent of the sniper rifle. Oh, okay. But uh, you know, I'll accept it. Let me see. Do I still look at that? Isn't that retarded? If you didn't notice, I should have a blood shield right now. And I don't. Why don't I have a blood shield right now? Because, uh... That's not what I meant to do. Um... I'm gonna do blood strike to get some more blood back. I should have a blood shield simply because I pressed the button. I should have butt shield. I mean, I said blood shield. I did it. And then I talked to that chick. Blood strike worked pretty well. Uh, I mean, I said blood strike, it blood shield, and then it just randomly got rid of it. Oh, what's going on? Oh, I got some zombies here. Some slow. Zombies. Can I get blood from you? Clearly know where I am. 
I mean, I guess it doesn't matter because, like, look how easy this is. <laughs> wow, he got totaled. Yeah, they got wasted. Look at these guys. Jeez. They didn't even have a chance. What's this? They didn't have a chance. They just got wasted instantly. So I, I shouldn't complain so much because uh, obviously that worked out pretty well in my favor. I just sneaked up, looked around, saw who was there, and anyone who I didn't like, I capped them. Pretty damn hard. Not a single one of them. actually interfered with my blood shield. Not a single one interfered with my blood shield. What's in here? I'm gonna sneak here. I'm gonna sneak. I'm gonna do the sneaky way. I'm gonna go uh, this way. There's nothing there. I haven't even needed to use my blood yet. Although, I mean, technically speaking, I shouldn't have been able to use Blood Strike. It should have made me sick as fuck because they're, uh. They're all, uh. Yeah, okay, let me get all this. They're all sick, so if I take blood for them, I should be sick. Correct? Well, I'm not complaining about that. If they're gonna bug, at least the, you know, at least there's occasional non-concerned bug that's in my favor. This video is almost over, by the way. That weird looking around is because of the stupid board and the odd physics they have for this game. Well, I'll need a rat. past I've done this with Blood Salvo. Can I get Blood Salvo? Oh my god, I can. Hell yes. Which is why we need to uh, change uh, Blood Shield. Well, we can do we can do uh, number six. Six. If we press uh, oops, sorry. If we press six we will get Blood Salvo. And there's a point coming up where that will be useful. This gun is actually far better than the, uh... There's no maps either, so if I get lost, that's the reason. There's no maps. I'll go check out over here. Uh, what's the other thing? We're getting close to the end of this video. That's where we came in, I think, maybe. Someone notices I'm here, but they can't attack me, so, okay. Uh, I'd probably kill them anyway, pretty quickly. So I'm not gonna worry about it. Is there a way out over here? No. Anyway, this video is almost over anyway. So I'm going to go ahead and call it quits here, and uh, I'll see you all guys next time. See you then.